Hey guys, Super Sonic Fan Benny here, and today I'm doing a review on a cool character. Today's person I'm reviewing is Michael Roeder. And yes, I am excited for this diecast. He looks very cool, and he is also in the Fireball Beach Racer series from Cars 3 or Cars. You know, it's just a little good thing right there. But anyways, this is him right here. I got, um, he looks very cool. And, um, and at the back right here, there's more racers. Hmm. Um, yeah, here's all, here's more racers. There's Chase Racelet, who I definitely dying to get. And there's Paul Conrev, there's Ryan Inside Laney, Sheldon Shifter, Jackson Storm, Daniel Suarez, Rich Mixon, and Sandy Cruz Ramirez. But, um, but yeah, I'm just, I'm just glad I finally have him. And so, um, so now speaking to which, let's get him out the box. Okay, so based on the Michael Roeder um, appeared at Car Street, uh, um, he's a next gen rookie who raced for um, for Vuzine, corrective windshields, and um, and then after um, the Los Angeles 500, Michael replaced um, Buck Barely as a previous um, Vuzine racer. So in the Ford 500. Michael is seen in many parts of the Ford 500. In in Cars 3, he was not involved in the wreck caused by Cam Spinner. And another thing too, as you can see, um, like um, like on the screen behind Natalie Certain when she was talking about Cruz on um, pairing in in the Ford 500, you can see that Michael's like in the race. You can like see him besides um, I think behind Paul Conrad or in front of him. But I'm not sure. But anyways, though, Michael Rota looks very cool, and it, and he got a few sale, sand details um, on the bottom of him. As you can see, he has no rookie stripes, so that's cool. He has the same he has the same tail lights like Daniel Suarez. So yeah, he looks very cool. Take a look between him and um but barely. They seem to almost look they seem to almost have to have the like same color though, but is it like like in a different darker um, version though? They seem to almost have the well not almost but seem to have the almost seem to have almost seem to have the same eye color. Both of them are 39. Yeah, so And decided like, it's a back view of both of them, the right side view of both of them, the top. And yeah, pretty much. So actually, Michael Roder is like, um, see, he is a 2018 die cast, so he is not, um, so I doubt that Mattel is going to make him um, without the sand details. But I mean, but like either way, this is still a cool die cast, and uh, yeah, it really is. So, but yeah, but anyways, though, yeah, Michael Roder was one of the few next gens that appeared in the four to five hundred. He yeah, replaced many teams. Yeah, cause like during the four to five hundred, most races got got replaced by next gen models. So, yeah. All right, so um, it would just give me a sec. Um, look at the biography of Michael Roeder. Okay, yeah, so um, it, yeah, so based on about him, the actual thing based on about him, um, then I 
All right. All right. So based on the bottom, Michael Roder, yeah, he replaced he replaced Buck Brandley for the 2017 season. You know, at the four to five hundred. And then so um, yeah so. So at the four to five hundred, he started at eleventh place and he finished the race at twelfth. So yeah. And so actually, um, see, and another thing too, Michael Roder, like his last name Roder, is is like a possible relative of Krusty Roder, you know, because Krusty Roder, Michael Roder, they both got the same last names. I mean, like, I mean, like, who knows if they're brothers or cousins, whoever. But yeah. Well, alright guys, guess that's all for today. If you want more video like this, just leave a like and a comment. And, um, and out of one of these two people, comment down below after you hear this. Who do you think I should review next? Chase Racelet or Paul Conrev? Just comment me at the bottom. Alright guys, see you later.